Yes, Juventini of the world, this was me crying in the Allianz Stadium. Not the first time I was crying in the Allianz Stadium because the first time I cried was for Juve Milan with a brace of Marquisio at the end. I also had some tears when I met for the first time Cristiano Ronaldo because it was something crazy. But this one, Juve Lazio, the farewell of Giorgio Chiellini and Paolo Dybala was the most emotional one. Something really crazy. I never experienced that before. I did a vlog eight minutes that you can discover how I started crying. You will see the images there from less than 24 hours from Belgium to Torino, Torino to Belgium together with my son. First time for him watching a game in the stadium. It was an amazing experience. The everything, the package was experienced. The package of the experience was really crazy. Bringing him and doing something together with your son, something that I will never ever forget. Being there for the last game of Il Cap but also from Il Picciriggio Paolo Di Bala that we saw growing from when he was 21 that first game versus Lazio until the last game versus Lazio was something epic something crazy 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 also something emotional for me because I went in Torino for the first time for my birthday in 2011 with my father he brought me there and a few years, years later, 11 years later, I'm bringing my son for his birthday, for his first Juventus game. Juventus Lazio was crazy. The game, absolutely not. It was beautiful with beautiful goals of Vlahovic and then Morata, especially the one of Morata was crazy. Watching Miretti closely was amazing. Watching Sergei Milinkovic Savic that also scored was crazy and epic. Maybe we will one day see him at Juventus. I don't know, but I already saw him live. And I'm already happy because it's an extraordinary player. But everything, the atmosphere from before the game, watching Chiellini entering for the last time, the stadium singing and chanting and cheering with so many chants. Also the anthem on Juventus, Juve Storia di un grande amore, was really great. A lot of goosebumps, my friends. Eight minutes, it will not be perfect. It's the first time I try to do a vlog. I'm not experienced enough, next time I will do uh, something else. The One of the things that also surprised me a lot and also was really strange for me was meeting some people in the Juve store in front of the stadium, walking towards the stadium, but also in Belgium when I came back that recognized me and say, G just Juve, Giuseppe, Beppe, whatever, whatever name. And they were super, super friendly from people from the channel that I met. I was super honored. It was really strange together with my son that was watching me. It was really, really a strange feeling, but that touched me a lot because a lot of people were really kind toward me and saying me, thank you. I I have to tell you thank you for the time that you're spending watching my videos but they were and you were telling me thank you for what I'm doing and everything I'm doing makes sense so I'm sorry if the quality of the vlog will probably not be the top Netflix quality I will try to do better the next time enjoy enjoy my experience and let me know in the comment what you found great and let me know also if this gave you also more motivation to one time go into the alien stadium and watch a game enjoy ciao juventini of the world look guys we are here airport it's 10 a.m in the morning about to go to torino juve lazio last game of Chiellini and dibala <laughs> stress emotions first time for my son We'll do an epic run. Epic. We are going to Turin. Few hours. Few hours of plane. Like a 1.30. And then we are in Turin. We arrived in Turin. Guys, it is just amazing. Every time I come to Turin, it's just amazing. We are in Piazza San Carlo. Look at that few hours before the game what we heard and you will probably know it when the video will be out is that a lot of players will be missing but we don't care together with my son we are here to party to say goodbye to Giorgio Chiellini to Paolo Di Bala Piazza San Carlo if you are ever in Torino this is a place that you have to see because here you have normally in the summer a lot of tables people are drinking are having fun are speaking especially about calcio Boy.
Guys, we are at the stadium. I don't know if you hear me well, but the atmosphere is fantastic and the game didn't start yet. The stadium is at the moment not full, but it is just fantastic. Really, guys, Juventus Lazio with a lot of new faces because we have a lot of absence, but the game will be just amazing, amazing. I just saw Romeo Agresti was speaking about Paul Pogba. Pay attention, pay attention. Di Maria, more yes than no. But we have to care about the stadium. I tell you, my friends, I saw a lot of people that knew me from the channel. I'm so honored. But guys, the stadium, that's why we are here. Guys, half time, half time, 2 0 for Juventus with goals of uh, Vlaovic, Vlaovic and Morata, the one of Morata. Mamma mia, mamma mia. Guys, I will show you some pictures and probably also some video. Me crying after Giorgio Chiellini being subbed off. I couldn't, couldn't keep my tears, my friend. It was difficult, really difficult. Giorgio Chiellini, what a honor to be here. What a honor. I'm super proud because I have chosen the game. The game, the stadium is on fire. after actually the morning a few hours later because before 6 a.m already woke uh, uh, awake 
exactly how I'm speaking. Look at my face, ready to take uh, the taxi to go to the to the airport, going back to Belgium. Mamma mia, guys, guys, unforgettable moment. It was really, really, really great. Everything, everything was epic. Look at me. Look behind, behind. You can see normally. You can see some. Uh, some mountains look at the mountains behind me it's really really beautiful really nice uh i don't know what to say just perfect perfect night perfect evening kellini dibala shocking shocking